I asked him what was the minimum. He said the least I can do was $100 and that will give me $3,100 and if I do $200, that will give me $6,200. And he also said that I will get a profit within 3 hours sent right back to me. What's up guys, I'm back with another video. This time I want to show you guys how so many people are getting hacked on Facebook. Also, I'll be uploading a lot more videos so be sure to turn on notifications and if you like the videos, drop a like for the algorithm. But with this video, I want to show you how a Facebook page can look very real but they're still trying to scam you out of your hard earned money. I'll get to the messages that seem very convincing and I'll also point out some key messages that made me feel like this was truly a scam and not the real deal so if you take a look through this facebook page with me this profile looks very legit and it very much seems like a real person that is trying to help you make some money you can go and check this page out for yourself to see that it really does exist i'll leave a link below as you can see there are always a lot of people tagged in a post and that is a big red flag to me because most scammers i run across are doing the same exact thing also if she helped so many people she would probably have more likes and more comments on the post where she claims to help people most likely the woman who owned this page was probably scammed into giving out her login information and her page was hijacked then after she created a new page i believe the scammers will go and get updated photos and videos to make it seem like this person is still uploading content now let's go to the conversation between myself and this page as you can see they messaged me first by asking me how my health was that was a red flag because who in america asked someone that question plus i never met this person a day in my life so it's not like i was sick and they knew about it I made a joke about it and I even called them a scammer but they just kept on going and I was kind of curious to see what they had to say. But before I started this conversation back and forth I made sure to turn on my VPN. A VPN is a virtual private network and I just use a McAfee antivirus software. This will allow you to search the web and communicate with others without giving your exact location. And it just keeps you anonymous while searching the web. You can even use McAfee to help store your banking information and passwords and a lot of other things. If you browse the web a lot, then you might want to consider getting a very good VPN. I believe I pay $149 a year for my VPN and it's worth every penny. Most scammers I come across on Facebook will ask you where you're from because they're already tracing your IP address and they want to know if everything matches up correctly. That's another big red flag to me. As you can see, this type of scam is not trying to get my login information, but instead it's trying to get me to deposit money in some sort of stock exchange platform. A lot of times, these platforms ask for personal information, so that could be a way for them to get more personal details about myself and my identity. So you always want to make sure that these type of platforms are trusted and just always do extensive research before buying into them. Right here, I even told the person that my VPN is working good and that the scam seems so different that it might end up on my YouTube channel. But they obviously didn't care and they just kept on going on with their script. Next, they tried to tell me that I could earn a profit within three hours after investing in Bitcoin. And if you ever invested into any stocks or any type of cryptocurrencies, then you would know that there is no guarantee that you will get a profit right away. But instead, it's a waiting game and in three hours, you could lose a little money before you start gaining any profit. That was a very big red flag and that might only work on someone who never, ever, ever invested in cryptocurrency or stocks at all. Then he goes on to tell me I will not be sending money to anyone and he also makes sure to add that I will get a profit within three hours again. Bullshit. As you can see right here, I asked if I will be investing money into my cash app and he replied to this exact message saying yeah so he knew exactly what message he was saying yeah to and right after that he goes on to say i have to invest money into his company's crypto platform that's the kicker what happened to my cash app investing he lied so that's another big red flag and this is a scam he automatically asked me how much would i like to invest as in to push me into doing something i have not agreed to yet also i would assume that the company's platform he's talking about is his and his accounts are probably directly linked to this account so he could receive all of the money that i sent to him after that i start calling him out saying only dummies fall for that and he even asked if i was scared we all know that that's just the way for people to try to get you to do things that you don't want to do we heard that question our whole life and we know what that means avoid whatever question is being asked stupid and scared are two different things he then told me that he was not forcing me to invest to make me feel like everything was my choice and he was not influencing me in any way i even told him bye a couple of times but this guy was persistent and was not giving up he even went as far as to ask for a video call to make it seem more legit i did deny it but just for the content i should have accepted it just to see what he did I did accept the video call before but the person didn't show their face and they had the camera face downward the whole time plus they was using an obvious voice changer. I kind of thought the same thing would happen again but next time I will accept it just so I can show you guys. As you can see right here I was telling them that I didn't believe anything that they were saying and they started to swear on their life. It sounded good but as you can tell they'll say anything to get a payday. Once again, even though I said that I was okay and I did not want to deposit anything, they were telling me to deposit the minimum to try it out. I can't lie, they were doing a good job and if I wasn't me, I probably would have failed for this scam. But I went in kind of knowing that this was a scam and I did not want to give any money away. But just for the laugh of it, I asked them what was the minimum. 
He said the least I can do was $100 and that will give me $3,100 and if I do $200, that will give me $6,200. And he also said that I will get a profit within 3 hours sent right back to me. I told him that he was good but not good enough to scam me and he pretty much got mad. I was thinking he must have finally saw my YouTube channel because he left me alone. To be fair, I told him to go away from the very beginning but he was very persistent and he would not stop. As you can see right here in all of the messages. But to sum everything up, you guys have to be careful out there because I get friend requests every day by scammers trying to scam me in different ways. Some people are very bad, some people are very good like this one. So be careful and always follow your gut if something doesn't seem right. I try to always tell you guys the truth and if you think I lied to you, then it was never my intention. But stay safe out there and look out for these type of Facebook scams because they can save you a lot of money and a lot of time. Until the next one, hope to hear from you all soon. Two fingers. Peace.